Here's today's In Touch devotion. Today's scripture reading begins in verse 7 of Matthew chapter 7. Jesus is speaking. Ask, and it will be given to you. Seek, and you will find. Knock, and it will be opened to you. For everyone who asks, receives, and the one who seeks, finds. And to the one who knocks, it will be opened. For what person is there among you who, when his son asks for a loaf of bread, will give him a stone? Or if he asks for a fish, he will not give him a snake, will he? So if you, despite being evil, know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more will your Father, who is in heaven, give good things to those who ask him? God's love has no limit, but that doesn't mean our behavior has no boundaries. While some people may argue that rules are stifling, any good parent knows limits are essential to raising children well, and so is continuing to love them when they break the rules. This may bring two questions to mind. One, why does the Lord have so many rules? They're designed to protect us and bring peace, but God doesn't force obedience. The Bible neither says nor implies that we have to live up to the Ten Commandments or the Sermon on the Mount in order to be loved. However, following God's rules is the path to joy and security. And two, what happens when I sin? No one is able to sin beyond the reach of God's redemptive grace. He will always forgive anyone who humbly asks. But grace is not a license to sin. The Lord will allow us to experience the consequences of sin. God loves without condition. To show His great care for mankind, He gave solid principles on which we're to build our life. His affection is in no way diminished toward those who ignore biblical rules, but His heart is grieved by their defiance. He delights in believers who seek His will and follow Him.